Hello YouTube, I'm going to battery in this. This is probably going to run out very quickly, but I might as well show you this is the start of the very first day. We've just land, uh, sorry, we've landed last night, got ourselves settled, and this was our first apartment just to be uh, in here for a night till we get into our apartment for the next month. So, where we are, we are in Crete in Greece, right? The island of Greece, it's fucking beautiful. This is literally our first day here, so we've got our first full day here. We only got here late last night, so we just went and got some food. But let me just show you quickly, we tour the gap before this runs out of battery. So, this is a bedroom where me and Lord Marie slept. This is a hallway, toilet, and then this is kind of a wee kitchen area. Where the cooking got done, living space, and this is a wee balcony. We can hear the noise of all these fucking whatever they are. But there you go, beautiful girl right there. Aye, madness. Anyway, that's the first apartment. I'll get this charged up and speak to you again very, very soon. What's happening, trips? Uh, so. First full day in Crete, I think I've told you that already, we're in Crete. Um, and basically me, me, Lloyd and Marie, we're going to go and try and find a gym just now. No, we don't have a clue where one is, we're trying to map it and get up to our main area and see if we can find one. Um, so it's pretty much scudding hot, I don't know if we can hear, ah, it's beautiful as well by the way, I don't know if you can see the mountains for here actually. Um, I don't think you can see them. No, I don't think you can see it now. Uh, wait a minute, time's a minute. In the background. Not very tall, don't know how well I'm doing. So, um, we've just checked into our apartment, the grandmama's house, and she's an absolutely lovely lady. Poppy picked us up, I don't know if Poppy's her name or what. Poppy's her name. Aye, uh, well, Poppy, you Poppy's cute. <laughs> so, I'm heading up to the gym now. I'll probably show you all their apartment um, after we get back from the gym. So, aye, let's go and get fucking into this first workout of the holiday. All the life, I mean. We sat in Cook, so we're at the first gym in Crete. Can't remember the name yet. I think it's called Mobage or something like that, right? So basically, right now I'm going to hit a pool workout. Right now, my pool workout, the main thing I'm focusing on is kind of thickness in my back. I'm getting thicker, not so much wider. So I'm focusing on a lot of rear delts in the middle of my back right now. So right now, I'm going to do a rear delt exercise. Really quick, right here. Bench here to basically eliminate all the momentum as well. You can do these standing, but it's very easy to get rocking. So, I want to try and kill all the momentum to make the real health points work much harder. So, second, well, last back exercise of the day. No, no, it's not kill, it's second last exercise of the day, right? It's going to be a low cable row. So, again, I've been doing a lot of rows this time, so I can have more kind of folks and squeeze all this together to try and make my back that a little bit thicker, right? So, now that I've done this exercise, and also those these new handles that I'm looking forward to trying, right? So, if I get to try and I'll let you know how it is.
just finished that pro workout. It was good. Lots of traffic there. It was very hard in the heat to be honest, I'm low end today, so it was a quite an intense workout. Uh, but it's still good to get that nice sweaty way. It just made it amazing. Cars and cars and cars. Getting nice and sweaty made it amazing, right? I love getting nice and sweaty when I'm working out and I really struggle to do that in Scotland because they're always so air con. This is air con, but it's still nice and humid. So I might as well show you the back pump. Hopefully it's looking nice and thick. But anyway, let's go get on with the rest of the day. So, we've just got a wee post workout meal. No, of course, when you're not making your own food, it's hard to track. So, if I'm eating out, I'll always try and go for foods where I can roughly track and I'll always overestimate them. So, I asked the woman what's in the omelette, and she says it was three eggs in the omelette. So, that's easy enough to track. I'm going to just assume there's some milk in there as well, right? Then I'll add them some oil, just because I know they'll probably cook it in oil. Then with the bacon, it's three slices of bacon, easy enough to track. Just use the kind of ones you've got back home. And again, I can account for some oil. But other than that, easy enough. Post workout meal, I'm going to guess, I've tapped my head, there's roughly 25 to 30 grams of protein in this. What is happening again, people? Hello. So, day one, not almost complete, it's about... Let me just tell you what time it is right now, actually. So it's quarter past seven, um, our time. Basically, uh, aye. so basically we've been out all kind of day, been to the gym, had some food. We also got quite a lot of shot in for like, obviously all kind of the remainder of our time here. Because we are here for so long, we're obviously going to be doing a lot of cooking. But we're also in a new apartment. So the first apartment we had was just for a night, basically because we had to wait for this one to open up. Wow man, I somehow looked tanned, don't know what the fuck's going down. Um, it's absolutely scorching in Crete by the way as well man, it's amazing, such a good place and wonderful people, everybody's been so friendly and dead helpful so far. But anyway, let us let me show you this apartment right, so I'll start from the balcony, it's called the Grandmama's house, it's lovely. So, I don't know what that noise is, I think it's fucking cockroach or something, but anyway, this is the wee door to kind of get into the actual area. Oh, the wee beautiful plants now that are here, absolutely lovely, we've got a wee beautiful Lord of in. Say hi. hi. <laughs> and then I don't know if you can quite see that, but the sea is just there. It's amazing. And then this is the apartment, so it's obviously a wee bit of a mess because we just came in. Just a nice wee chill gaff. Mirrors and that here. Oh, look at this thing I also got as well. I've got a stick for holding my camera because oh, my vlogger now, isn't it? It also has this wee thing where it comes down to the bottom. You can just get lazy and it pulls it at the same height for you. But aye, so this is it. So we've got two single beds, they'll be getting pushed together tonight. Or Lauren Bree might be getting left on her Todd. We've got a TV that hopefully has Love Island on it. Um, this is our kind of wee dining table, I guess, a wee chilled chair. My laptop currently uploading the original vlog. Uh, for the first one, here we have here Lauren Marie's pet, Prince. Funny story, he's actually a travelling pet and he's born in 420. And he's our trippy kid, supposedly. And then we've got a kind of wee table and chairs again. We've got a two suitcases just sitting out. And then this is a kind of wee kitchen area. So this is not the hob, it's electric. Sinks, all that shit. Coffee maker, which is essential. Laurie Marie, I've just realised something. We should have got powdered coffee, we could have made it in that cafeteria. I know, we should have that out. Hey ho. We had to go and buy food scales, by the way. Ten are, but totally worth it. Just a kind of wee fridge down here. Again, a wee electric hob, microwave. Wash bag, masks, my phone, but but anyway, oh, and just like in a wee bathroom as well. So that's storage here. Again, more storage in here. I guess that's a decent wee mirror. And then we have the bathroom as well, toilet, and we can of shower. So just a nice wee simple gaff, but it's got kind of everything we are looking for, which is great. And um, it's in a wonderful place as well. The beach is literally. I think less than five minute walk, so that's class. The kind of main wee town, but it's about 20 minutes walk away, but we don't mind walking, we're walkers. Um, but aye, so it's been a good kind of first full day, getting our kind of finding our feet and stuff like that, but um, we'll go get a wee bit more into it tomorrow. But anyway, catch up with you in the next of this video. Um, so, can't remember where I left the last bit. Pretty sure we're kind of almost ending the night, so. It's now a good bit later on. Time's at it's at nine thirty, um, and we just oh, that's nine thirty my time. We are two hours ahead, so I just watched 
Love Island again, think me, Lauren Marie, that's what we've got set up because you can't miss that. Um, and then we're just going to have some chicken pasta, so I'll show you that when we're done and then I'll likely continue this on to tomorrow when we've got some more exciting stuff planned. So there's mine with 200 grams of chicken breast, 150 grams of pasta, obviously a pasta sauce as well. We just make it spicy and then Lauren Marie's had, it was yours just pasta? Yeah. Just passed in hers, so aye, it's looking hell of a tasty. Well, I've got a wee aesthetic picture of it now, because it doesn't count if you don't take a picture. Good morning, people. So it's the next day, and uh, it's about 8 o'clock in the morning. I don't know if you can hear that noise, but this is like a constant noise in Keats. I'm assuming it's, like, we think it's maybe cockroaches or crickets or something. I'm not sure, but it's like a 24-7 thing. It's set to late at night, which is mad. But anyway, minus that noise, we coffee to start the day. Out in the, what's this called? Okay. Landing. Veranda. The veranda. Um, I think it's a mum, most likely for a boot. Fucking love it. Don't you, huh? Mm-hmm. Bye. Nicky, you man. I don't know, you're cute, and oh, you're getting the muscles up. Solid. Right, what's happening? So, we're basically just about to go up to the gym. It's roughly nine, half nine. It's half nine ish you now. Um, basically, i going up to the gym. It's chest, shoulders, and tricep day, which is decent, and then I'm going to go to the beach. So, let's go hit the gym again. What's happening people? So, just about finished my workout, right? I've got bench press in it. Some dudes on it, so I can do it a wee bit later, right? Anyway, what I'm going to be doing is I've been doing a push workout today with chest and shoulders and mostly triceps, right? Basically focusing on width from the back to the front, so I'm trying to get a lot of chest, a lot of front delts right now. And again, kind of hitting the triceps, right? So, I've got to show you my bench set up and what kind of how I do it. If you'd like to know my full chest workout and how to do it, leave a comment down below or if you have any workouts or body parts you want to really work on, comment down below and I'll show you exactly how to maximise muscle growth in them. So with this I'm going to take a more narrow grip compared to what you usually see people doing and I'm going to make sure I've got a massive arch on my back and my shoulders are going to be pinned right back and down, like so. So now I've got a big arch on my back, shoulder width, just outside shoulder width. And there you go, stop one rep shy, but there we are. What's happening? So, just finished a uh, workout. We've already done well, some legs and glutes, and I just done chest, triceps, shoulders. It's a good workout. Again, loving being in the gym, motion hot, sweating while well training. Just makes it so much better. Pump gets insane, and you just look well better because you're all shiny, so it's great. It's fine. So, now we're going to go and get some food, I'm assuming. Are we getting some food? Yeah. Get some food and then we're going to go to the beach. Look at that sign, here's what this beach is. What's that? What does that say? That's what it's been in racism. Oh, That's pretty cool, isn't it? Nice. Oh, hello. So we basically we've had a bit of a long day at the beach. We went and got some food there. If you had me on Instagram, you'd have seen that. But we're just kind of currently walking through Hanya. Kind of made me a bit of creep. Oh, kind of maybe a bit near us. Um, as I say, we're at the beach all day, we've got some amazing food, we're at a, an amazing pier. But I wonderful place, we kind of forgot to vlog, uh, uh, to be honest. Um, but know what? Life's for living, no for recording. So, aye, so that's going to be the end of this video. Hopefully, you enjoyed that. Ciao.